Hey everybody, Dustin Bradley here with Bradley Brothers. Today we're in Santan Valley, Arizona, and we're gonna check out this four bedroom, three bathroom home. It's sitting on 3.5 acres, and you have a pasture over here, and then you have one over here, and this is just the front of the property. So this is where you pull in. It's a small gated subdivision of just a few homes. They do share well, so your water costs are gonna be really minimal. It's a total of four bedrooms, three bathrooms, 3,159 square feet. It does have a pool. It was originally built in 2004. There's a total of five garages. So you have this kind of detached one right here that's two, and then the main house has a three car garage. And I think I mentioned, but it is a small little gated community, which is pretty nice. They've let the landscaping go a little bit, so there is going to be a little bit of work. This house is listed at $1,100,000. That door just leads to the uh, hot water heater and uh, AC. And then over here, there's kind of this bonus space. It has its own door. It looks like it's set up to like be an apartment of some sort. So maybe it's a little efficiency. Throw some carpet in. Little kitchen. It's already plumbed. Already has a bathroom. Full shower. So it might be a way to have an in-law or produce a little bit of income. Really nice. I mean, 3.5 acres in a really central location in Santan. You're going to be have access to anywhere very quickly you're right off ironwood so now we're in the backyard we're going to do the whole outside first got pavers built-in barbecue here is the pool Oh, I can hear some horses. Got a little fire pit. Once again, the house is does have some things that are going to need to be addressed. So there is going to be some uh, updating that's going to need to happen. Looks like over here we have some stuff maybe for a chicken coop or other type of livestock possibly. I don't have access. I don't have the key to this. But you know, it looks like we have a little horse uh, 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 area over here and a little detached garage. I've been seeing some rabbits run around. So huge piece of uh, property. Pool looks like it's in good shape. It's a Pebble Tech pool. And then this over here must be some type of water feature. I don't think it's a hot tub doesn't have any seats so maybe it's a water feature that possibly overflows oh look at all the rabbits uh, you probably can't see them nice big covered patio Well, if you enjoy this type of content, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our videos. We shoot one to two of these a day every day with the goal of really keeping buyers and sellers aware of what's going on here locally in the market. And it's a way for us to show our out-of-state clients properties that they're interested in. So if there's a property you want to see or if you're ready to sell or buy, get a hold of us. Our contact information is down in the description. And if you just have any questions about the market in general or this house, get a hold of us and uh, we'd love to help you out. Okay, so now we're back at the front of the property. Let's explore this a little bit more over here.
this is the type of house you're really buying for the property. Very private, very secluded. Looks like we have some raised garden beds over here that have been overgrown. They did mention that there was a leak that they have had fixed. Uh, they're, they're in the process of having it fixed. It's leaking in one of the closets. And they are uh, trying to get the landscape under a little more control. Really pretty front door. Nice, massive front door. I like this style. All right, as you walk in, you're going to notice the beautiful tile floor. Straight ahead, we have a sunken formal living room that has a fireplace that can be seen from both sides. I'll show you that when we go over there. So a nice uh, sunken living room. Has views of the pool. Nice tall ceilings. Great, great height to the ceilings and then off of the front door we have beautiful French doors that lead into bedroom number one they're all eight foot doors which is a great upgrade and then on this side of the house we have the primary bedroom and then a bathroom this is going to be used when you're going in and out of the pool you got a shower so you can come shower off when you hop out of the pool. French doors leading into the primary. Nice size primary bedroom. Once again, really nice height to the ceilings. Paint looks like it's in good shape. And then we have two walk-in closets. One right here. And then a little bit of a larger one on this side. And then the primary bathroom. We do have the claw foot bathtub. And then the walk in shower here. Oh, nice, very large walk in shower. Got the rainfall shower head up there, as well as the traditional shower head. Okay, so we're gonna pass the bedroom over here, the front door, the formal living rooms off to my right. And now we're into the heart of the home. As you can see, the kitchen just flows right into the main living room right here. Here is the other side of the fireplace. So you can enjoy it from both sides. Might be pretty cool to maybe mount your TV potentially right above the fireplace. I don't see, yeah. Another big window with views of the pool. Tons of cabinets. And then you have a dining area over here. It's kind of a small table for the space. And then as well as a door to the backyard right there. The uh, Sorry, the counters are going to be these 12 by 12 granite tiles. Oh, a little bit of uh, missing tiles right here. That's going to need to be addressed. These are upgraded cabinets. These are, look like they're 42 inch cabinets. So nice and large, plenty of space in there.
really large laundry room. Tons of cabinets in here as well. And they carried the granite tile countertops out here. Space for a fridge. Got a full kitchen back here. So it's the laundry room. And then the three car garage. Looks like the hot water heater was leaking a little bit over the years. Nice oversized three car garage. Couple more bedrooms over here. So we saw two on the other side and then uh, there's gonna be two more over here. Here is the bathroom that these two bedrooms share. Here is bedroom number three. All the bedrooms are nice size. And then bedroom number four. So four bedrooms in the main house. I think this is where we have the leak. Yeah, so it looks like they've been doing some work. There's the light. So they're addressing the leak, getting all this fixed up. Nice big walk-in closet in here. And so four bedrooms in the main house and then that little guest house over there that needs to be finished. Five car garage plus the garage space, storage space in that horse corral back there. Nice wide open layout. And if you have any questions, let us know. If you've made it to the end and you haven't subscribed, think about smashing that subscribe button. And if you've gotten value out of today's video, give us a thumbs up. And uh, we appreciate you taking the time to view our videos. We hope that they are helpful. And when it's time to buy or sell, give us a ring. Love to help you out. Have a great day.